Hello guys, welcome back. This is Slash and Smash speaking, and this is episode 5, uh, part 2, because I did a little bit of episode 5 in on the episode 4 at the end. Uh, so hello, uh, this is the Roderick side of things. Uh, so hope you enjoy, please subscribe and like, and let's go. <laughs>
Kami adopted in bar by the foster or foster by boys aged three and a half. Oh, please, Lady Marjorie, please don't send me back to Highgarden. Finally, you grace us with your presence. I was beginning to think you'd found someone else to serve. Sorry if I kept you waiting. I came as quickly as I could, my lady. I'll get to you in a moment. Do you realise how precarious my position is with Cersei? Of course, my lady. Of all the people in King's Landing, you steal from the Queen I Regent. I didn't mean... Did you know about this? Sarah's been stealing wine. From Cersei, no less. Sarah told me about it, my lady. I... I had a sip with her. If you wanted wine, you should have just asked. Oh, I'm sorry, my lady. We only had a little. <sighs> God's the pair of you. I'm sorry. I shouldn't get so flustered. It's just, I need order in my household. Until I'm married to Tommen, I can't afford any more mistakes. I have no choice but to make changes among my handmaidens. Tommen's garden party, Mira. What were you thinking? I can't believe you'd be so irresponsible. I expected better of you. I had urgent business there, my lady. People were counting on me. Otherwise, I would never have disobeyed you. <sighs> I'm sure you had your reasons, Mira. You always do. At least you're honest about it. Sarah's been saying some damning things about you, Mira. I suspect in an effort to save her own neck. My lady, please. You've said enough. One of you must answer for this. Sarah says you used her to get you into the party. You've been with me a long time, Mira. When I'm queen, I'll need people I can count on. Please, tell me this isn't true. Please, Mira. I don't deserve to lose my position for this. My lady, I... I'm sorry. Sarah's telling the truth. This has been building for some time, Lyra, but it still breaks my heart. I've been nothing but good to you. I've put up with your schemes. I've even tried to help you and your family where I could. And you repay me with this. I feel betrayed. I won't have it. Oh, forgive me, Lady Marjorie. Oh, I promise you it won't happen again. You're right, it won't. I can no longer have you near me, Mira. Consider yourself dismissed from my service. But, but, but my lady... I said get out. for me. I expected I'd be on my way to High Garden by now. I couldn't let you take the fall. You need Marjorie's protection more than I do. Don't worry about me. 
I'll be fine. I hope you're right about that. But thank you. I know you didn't have to do it. I wish things had turned out differently. But I suppose this is goodbye. I'm not sure when. I'm not sure we'll see each other again. Tarwick is a lovely man. Good luck with your wedding. Thanks, Nura. I'll send you an invitation. There's something I need to tell you. Something I heard. There are some vile rumors going on about you. Rumors? About you murdering a Lannister guard. I thought you should know. Thanks, Sarah. Careful, Mira. You're on your own now. Well, the loading on this game takes so long, to be honest. Oh, my days. Villages. We should have raided them. You didn't come here to pillage the countryside. We didn't come to get ambushed either. But plans change. I can't believe my little brother's gone. All that bloody fool wanted was to come back to Westeros and fight for his family. I told him it was stupid. That we had a good thing going across the narrow sea. But he did it anyway. All for a family who cast him out. Who banished him to the other side of the world, but begged him to return when they needed him. It all comes back to Lud Whitehill. He's the reason Asher left. And the reason he finally came back. Fucking Whitehills. I keep expecting to turn my head and see him riding beside me laughing at the idea that he, of all people, could actually be dead. But then I turn and it's just you. N no offence. It's just a... not how I expected this would go. Asha died to save my life. I'll never forget it. He was a caring idiot. I'll give him that. Him and I, we used to sneak out of Ironrath and get drunk on me, the Chandler's daughters. And he could drink like a fish, but I'd get so drunk he'd have to help me walk home. <laughs> One time he even carried me. We did the same thing once, actually. Except it was Valerian fire whiskey and a butcher's girl. He was a good little brother, wasn't he? He was. 
If I do just one more thing in this piss life of mine, it'll be to make those bastards pay. You'll get your chance. The White Hills are coming for us, have no doubt. But before we deal with them, Roderick needs to tell his mother that she's lost another son. Roderick, where is your brother? I, I don't understand. Did Asher not arrive? He, he wouldn't have missed the ship. This may be hard to understand. Asher gave his life so that I could keep mine. No! Easy, I've got you. Oh, Asher, you brave, foolish boy. Trip. My lord, the people loved Asher. Asher is dead, murdered, but mark my words, we will avenge him. Any man, woman or child bearing the name Whitehill will pay the price for his death. And how will you do this? With plows and swine? Asha brought us here to fight, but Asha's dead. What's coming isn't battle, it's slaughter. You don't know the first thing about our wars. Bah! You think we can't see the difference between strength and weakness? Your people are terrified. <laughs> Your walls are made of wood. What's to stop us taking what we want and leaving this shithole? There is food, gold, weapons. We could make out well here. You try it and I'll kill every last one of you myself. You couldn't take the weakest of us. Why don't you test me? Fuck! He's nothing like Usher! And you're nothing like real shell swords. Yet you want us to fight like you. What I want is for you to obey Lord Roderick. He's not our lord. Show some respect. Doesn't mean shit. Oh, fuck. War is coming. Do you understand? If we fight amongst ourselves, we're dead. If we mistrust each other, we're dead. Either we band together, or Ironrath will be the last place any of us ever see. Shoot him. I bring a message from the Lady Gwyn. Fuck's sake, it always lags. I can't grab it. No. Gwen? Gwen, okay, guys. I'm gonna end it there and I'll see you in a minute.